Devil's Reef. The land itself seemed wrong, in some subtle way that I could not precisely divine. The moonlight fell at an unnatural angle, causing the island to not visibly be there. Also, because um, this game, this part of the game really reminds me of it. Um, if you enjoy board games and don't already know about it, there is a wonderful Arkham Horror board game where you play an investigator much like our hero Jack Walters, um, with up to like seven friends and you play against the board. It's a lot of fun. And there's a Shadow Over Innsmouth expansion involving Deep Ones and Dagon and fish people going crazy. Big part of the game. Um, so look it up. It's a lot of fun. Anyway, Reef of Satan. February 10th, 1922, early evening. Did I really just see what I think I saw? Or was it another hallucination? I can't be sure any longer. Surely these things can't exist in any rational universe, but then, how could any human imagination, even an insane one, produce such horrors? And why do some of the things, the shapes, the words they use seem so familiar? That's the question that's eaten me. Are they connected to my lost memories? And if so, what on earth happened to me during the six missing years? Or was it even on Earth? I don't know. I need to get a grip on myself, see? And look for any other survivors from the wreck of the Urania. I hope I'm not alone on this hellish rock with these... these things. I must be careful, though. I have seen for myself what they do to unwelcome visitors. See? Okay, now we can turn the mouse the hell down. Because we never have to touch that damn cannon again. Ever. I bet I lost all my guns, too. Uh, got a crowbar? No. What, really? We have all our guns? <gasps> Jack! You rock! You have a lot of ammo for most of them. Okay. I'd say it's time to go kick some ass. How about you guys? You get tired of these damn fish people. Sky overhead. Hmm. I wondered if we could get in here. And there's an elephant. Which we go and take. That was a pretty easy boss fight, all things considered. Walk it off, pussy. That doesn't look good. What the hell? I don't know, you tell me, Jack. What the... What the hell was that? Didn't hurt very bad. Just hit me in the face really hard. Great. Now we have Indiana Jones-style traps to deal with, everyone. It's never easy. Gotta be getting close to the end of the game. There's not a lot of landmass left to fight on. The winds here are fierce, and there isn't much shelter ahead. I need to be careful. I'm not supposed to go that way. Let's go this way instead, since this is the way the winds push. You need to be lucky to worship an unsaid god. We're heat of human sacrifice. Hi, Zadok. How you been, buddy? Stupid rocks. Ah. What the hell? Doubloons! Go! This must be where they sacrificed to be. A strangely carved disc. Indeed it is. Oh, you go through this in the water and there's some of the critters. Throwing it in the water is a bad idea. Besides, it might come in useful. It might come in useful, see? What are you doing trying to throw that thing away? You goofy bastard. That was great. So that's what we get to deal with now. Awesome. Shoddy jumping mechanics. The winds here are fierce, and there isn't much shelter ahead. I need to be careful. Oh, you 
Pit trap, score yourself three points. I really don't like these stakes in the walls. Am I stuck? Duck. Mmm. You think it's another pit trap? Mmm. Score yourself three more points, everyone. Points can be turned in after the show for sexual favors. That was a Gallagher bit. We liked him, huh? Like smashing fruit guy. Oh, crap. Yep, saw it right after I jumped down there. Okay, see, aren't you glad we saved after getting a little metal disc thingy? I am. Dude. I like how it falls right as you snow. Uh, it's those damn starfish. Do anything with the torch? Of course we can't. We got the Book of Dagon still. We got that weird ruby thing. So, the point of the pit traps is probably to just make you deal with those stupid starfish. So, hang on. No, it's down there. Oh, okay. So, you're not supposed to go here. That's stupid. You're supposed to go to here with us as well. Excuse me. He's got some seaweed in there. Yeah, so we're going to the save point, see? Save, because I'm tired of doing this crap, see? Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Start turning the Betty. There's a plate in the rock here. It's been removed, was it? Throwing it in the water's bad. Was it Ruth's brooch? Was it a gemstone? Was it the Book of Dagon? Besides, it might be useful. No, it's, it's something. And that's just it. Maybe we are supposed to go down here then, guys. I don't know. Nope. Definitely not the way we're supposed to go. Good stuff. Good stuff. There's a plate in the rock here. Something has been removed. It really looks like I'm supposed to put this in here. Isn't that... Doesn't that kind of look like the thing the movie was set in? Cthulhu place? Oh, definitely not. Definitely not. But, we can watch Jack die. Baby. 
not taking no more guy from this Waldos fella, see? I'll be back at the beginning. This... Yeah, all the way back at the beginning. That's dumb. It's over here. Oh yeah, this is where... I got a gun, so you just shut the hell up. Anything with this stuff? Look for the obvious solution. Solution. Yep. Ready for you, Bubba. Come on down and get some. I am not worried about your stuff. I will shoot you many times in the face. With a very large gun. It must be a warning. I better watch my step. You think, Jack? That's cool. The stupid lead disc thing. Unless we miss something not obvious over there. Looks like spikes from the first pit. Cute. Oh, I see. It pushes us forward into the death. Maybe we can sneak past them without them jumping on my face and making me squeal like a little girl. What do you think, guys? I sure don't think so. I think if they're gonna jump on my face, I'm gonna squeal like a little girl. Okay. Oh, gee! There's more of them! Good lord, there's a lot of these things! How is this the only way in here? Hurt me too bad though. What the hell is in here? Get the blood off my face. Good the Lord. rock surface the mural is set on seems to be slightly worn. It depicts the fishmen breeding with humans. This would oh, have happened yeah. to those in Innsmouth that took the third oath of Dagon. Sexy time. Snoo snoo. There is a disc missing from the engraving. I have a disc. It seems to depict the summoning of the fishmen by the casting of discs into the ocean waves. Okay, fair enough. What else you got for me? An okay. old pulley. Pulley, great. That's fantastic. Jack, you never cease to amaze me. You found an old pulley. The mural shows humans worshipping the fishmen and Dagon. Uh, well, I'll take your word for it, because I can't see anything. I'm losing my cookies. This lever is the only object in the hoard of treasures not constructed from gold. That's pretty awesome. This whitish gold reminds me of the hidden vault in the marsh refinery. A Cthulhu hat. Made out of solid gold. Tell me you couldn't sell that.